birthday. It's her birthday. It's her birthday. Well, happy birthday. What's her name? Sharon. Sharon, happy birthday. I'm going to tell you, that's from Arkansas. I am so happy to meet you. Speak your point. I bite. I bite. I just figured out more. Somebody said, oh, yeah, Jackie bites. She's got sharp teeth and she bites. I figured out. I just said, everybody, I bite. Oh, time it to where we bring everybody. There you go. I just didn't do that because I'm in a whole bunch of fun. I didn't know. It's okay. It's okay. All right. <laughs> and you are? Oh, my Miss Lucy. Miss Lucy is nice to meet. See, Doug just wants to come find me. That day, too. She didn't tell me nothing. I stopped by her friend. She wouldn't even open the door. She said, Well, I'm tired. I'm getting cold and I'm going to stay in. But she said, They're having a bonfire. You go there and do stuff. So that's what I'm doing. Well, you know, I saw over there just a little while ago. Oh, I didn't mean to ask you because we're getting married. Sorry, what? What again? She gave me a ring what? We gotta check with you first. It's okay. Me? She don't. She, let, she sure. don't let me in none of her business. I try to get into it. She don't let me. <laughs> Okay, then you're not going to be family, so you're okay with that? Well, I don't care. It works for me. I love everybody. And you got a beautiful smile, so I'm thinking we're going to get along fine. Will you smile when I'm not? Because I don't smile a lot. All right. No worries. Well, you know, I thought it was going to be a lot of food around here than it was last night. It was really cold. And I waited for that to get up. I just knew she'd come find me. I knew where she was, but I put her over there on the other side of the world. Well, I thought I saw her go over there looking for me. I didn't know where she was, but she didn't come find me because I didn't see her. Until I went by her rig just now and I, and I tapped on her. I said, Dubs, I know you're in there. I just, because I knew her. I'm going to see her a little bit. She's going to teach me how to play that cornhole game over there. She is? She is. How long ago was she supposed to do that? She said to me she wasn't coming back out. Oh. She's going to stand me up. Is she supposed to come out? Let's go find her. Okay, let's go find C. Dubs. All right, where's C. Dubs? Well, I know where she is. She's back at her rig. I'm telling you, I just went by there. We're going to have to go get her out Let's go get her. Now, I hear if we scratch on the side, really irritating. Be careful. Well, I hear she, she has hollow points. We'll get, <laughs> we'll get a reaction, okay? <laughs> May She's not be the reaction we want. <laughs> now, she won't be trying to hurt you, but I don't, you know, I was a surprise because my mom and Paul left me a note when they died, and I found out, and I found I had a sweet sister in, in Texas. And so when I told her that last year, I tried to tell her that. She kind of got it by word of mouth. She would never talk to me. She avoided me like the plague. You know what I mean? Anyway, so, yeah, she's she's trying to process it all. I think she's got it. And she's she's going to be all right. But I guess she wasn't ready for me to be on all of her friends. That's okay. You can tell her you met us all, and we love you and just as much as we love her. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, you're going to be fun, Ken. I can tell already. Yeah. Especially at the holidays. Feed me. <laughs> Feed you. See you guys later. I, I don't cook. Uh-oh. <laughs> and and I, I'm, we, we, see, I don't think Dubs cooks either. Do you cook? Y'all might rethink that marriage thing unless y'all like to have a lot. We're gonna have to have to get us a sister wife <laughs> to do the cooking. <laughs> no, wait a minute, we're gonna have to go around and find a sister wife. Who do you think cooks? How do you just come back back Arkansas yeah, and we got all kinds of sisters? She's got all of the uh, oh, pots of frugal gal over there. That girl right there, she gets sister wife. Yeah, I think she could be a sister wife. She cooks. She does cook and she's kinda of pretty too. <laughs> she do, is do you do we, we need a sister wife because she was found out just now that doves don't cook. No, I don't cook. <laughs> And so you cook. But you See, she said we need a sister wife. So we, we asked. This it. ring is big enough for the both of us. Right? Yeah, the dubs getting your ring. I thought she knew. It's got a big rock on it. It does. It does. It's a, big, it's a pink diamond. Really? Yeah, it is. Here we go. <laughs> she put it on my finger and she asked. Oh. I got to get sized, you know. <laughs> No, I didn't know. I didn't know anything. Don't, don't tell me nothing. Is it okay if you're a sister wife? Are you a C-Dubs? I don't know. Maybe I should right? And nobody else cooks. No, but you, you know what? <laughs> That's going to be kind of where she can't be a sister wife. Because I think her and her, 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 uh, Dubs, they've been friends for like over 30 years. That just wouldn't be right. you yeah. <laughs> got to find another sister wife. I don't know. I know it's Dubs like her. I love Judy her too. Could. That just wouldn't be right. Judy, Judy, could you come in for a second? <laughs>
Judy. Judy, Judy, Judy. We're looking for a good cook. Don't go. Don't go. We're looking for a good cook. We need somebody. <laughs> Hey, C Dubs. Hey, what are you doing? Good to see you. I'm I, radio, and I'm sorry. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. Actually, I have a question for you. Um, you know, I, a couple of weeks ago, I ran into Sharon, and she told me something that just shocked the heck out of me. What did she say? <laughs> well, she told me. That you and her had gotten engaged. She showed me the ring and everything. <laughs> that we got engaged. Yeah, she showed me the ring and everything. Big pink diamond. Huh. Well, how did that come about? Did she say? She said that you popped out this ring and you asked her to marry her. Oh, I remember that. Yeah, I looked over at her and she didn't have any jewelry on it, so I thought. And that's the first thing that popped in my head. You know how I am. It's just right off the cuff all the time. Oh, but, you know, she also told Martha Jane. Well, we know how Martha Jane is. She probably went way out in the universe with that. First, she was, like, just really, really shocked. Um, but then she just started going on and on. And I tell you, she even, she said that you can't cook. And so that Sharon better know how to cook, unless y'all wanted to eat out a lot. Well, and then, so Martha Jane, she decided y'all needed a sister wife. What? A sister wife? <laughs> yeah, because you need somebody that'll cook. Because then you don't cook unless y'all wanted to eat out a lot or something. I know that girl knows I was just funning with her. <laughs> uh, no, I don't. I think Sharon and Martha Jane both were pretty pretty serious. Donna, <laughs> you know me and you know my shenanigans. I just gotta go off with a moment and then it's, you know, it's out and it's gone. <laughs> so, you're saying y'all aren't engaged? Not for real times, no. Not for real times? What kind of times? Well, not in every time. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's not a serious thing. Oh, okay. But you and Sharon... This was a couple weeks ago, so are you and Sharon still talking? Have you talked to her lately? I don't have Sharon's phone number. What <laughs> <I get you? laughs> oh, wow. I, okay. All right, then. Well, what about Martha Jane? Last time, whenever I saw her and was talking to her, she said she went by your rig, you didn't answer, and she just thought you were avoiding her like the plague. She's my sister. But I'm supposed to trade her. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you know, Martha Jane is out here. She went to some camp the other day when we were partying here. Yeah. She didn't come, and she went to somebody else's camp and was went to a party, and I really haven't seen her or heard from her, but I know she's all right. She's a pretty independent girl. Oh, well, uh, okay. Well, maybe we'll see her down the road sometime soon, eh? Yeah, but I probably need to let her know that she's not going to have a sister-in-law. <laughs> that might not be a bad idea, because I tell you, she really was hunting for y'all to have a sister wife. I mean, she was hunting pretty hard. She tried to pull frugal in. <laughs> what? Yeah. 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 But, but, you know, uh, Martha Jane, then she figured out, yeah, frugal and, and, and C-Dubs have been friends for a long, long time, so she kind of backtracked on that one. Well, yeah, Frugal and I are best friends. Okay, so we're not going to hear wedding bells anytime no, soon, No, 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 no. She was fun. We had a lot of fun at uh, City of Rocks. Uh -huh. and, um, she took me uh, to help me find all the, the little treasures that I didn't, hadn't been on. Oh, what fun. And, uh, so that was fun, and we did that and had a good time and uh, didn't get to tell her bye. She moved campsites, and uh, I went by looking for her, and they'd already split, so... Bye, Sharon. If you see this, I had a lot of fun with you. Nothing serious, you know what I mean? All right. Well, thank you, C-Dubs, for uh, talking to me today. And we'll just move on to the next news down the road. All right. Sounds good to me. Thank you, Donna. I'll talk to you later. Boy, that was some serious stuff, girlfriend. She didn't take me. I can't go that fast. We need a
a sign. Put your sign. Put your sign. Put your sign. So that you can do something. So oh. Okay. So she said y'all got engaged. You gotta get so shocked. 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 That we got engaged. <laughs> Only in fantasy time, maybe. Wait, that didn't sound right either. You know how I mess up. I trip over my own words.